Let me show you how we can take advantage of AI to help us build a form on JotForm for a smart home improvement service. It's going to let us know what elements we need to drag in into JotForm and it's going to save us a ton of time with all the suggestions that it's going to provide us. So let's get started. Welcome to Job Form. My name is George, and today I'm going to show you how we are going to use AI to help us build a form and let us know what elements we're going to need to add on our form based on the business that we have. So if there's not a template, well, this is going to help us decide what we're going to use. Now, for the AI service, we're going to use ChatGPT, and you can open up a free account right away. Now, on the bottom of ChatGPT, there's a little request bar. So it's not a search bar, it's actually a request bar. And in this section, we're going to ask it what we're going to need. So let's go ahead and type in the request that we need to get started. So let's tell it what business we have and what we want to do with it. So we want to request it to help us decide what type of elements we need on a form. So let's get started. All right, so I just wrote the first request, which is let us know what elements I need to add for a form on JotForm for my business home improvement service. OK, so let's click enter and it's going to start writing for us. So it's going to start with this. So let's wait for it to finish. OK, so ChatGPT just finished writing what we need and it helped us out with some of the elements. So it, we need the name and contract information, service request the budget or time frame, budget, attachments, terms and conditions, submit button and confirmation message. Now that's pretty random, right? I, I told you that we're gonna use this for a specific business. So we're gonna tell it this is for a home improvement that is focused on smart homes, okay? So let's see what type of elements it's gonna add for us or change. So let's go ahead and tell them. Okay, so we just wrote the request, which is my business is more focused on home improvement for smart homes. What elements should I replace or add? So let's click enter again and let's see what it suggests us now. Okay, ChatGPT just finished writing the suggestions for the elements that we need to add. And I think it's really interesting because some of these elements might have never been added on the form or it might have passed us by until someone asked about it. And then we're going to say, hey, you know what? I should ask, I should add that in the form. And in this case, it helps us out. For example, the type of smart home system, so Alexa, Google Home, or Apple Home Kid, or maybe another one that's more specific, but that's a really good question for this specific type of business. The next one, smart home devices, like what do you want to add? In this case, thermostats, lighting, locks, smart security cameras, etc. Home automation, network information, smart home app access, price range, like how much you want to pay, availability, service plan, submit button, and confirmation message. Now, I like the elements that it's going to suggest us. Now, how are we gonna implement this on JotForm? Well, let's go ahead and ask it. Okay, so I just wrote the request and it says, how do I implement these elements in JotForm? Also, let me know what type of elements I should drag in JotForm to the builder. So again, let's click enter and see how it's going to let us know what we should do. Okay, so it just finished right now and it's telling us step by step, even logging in, choose a template, a blank template, and drag these. Drag in the full name element, the phone number, the drop down, a checkbox, a file upload, a number, multiple choice, and submit button. Now it's giving us suggestions for the first elements that it gave us. Now, what about the other suggestions that it provided? So let's ask it to add them here. Okay, so we're telling it. Also add in the form the other suggestions for the smart home elements. So let's click enter and have them, well, have ChatGPT tell us how to add those also. Okay, so it just finished for the rest of the elements. And again, for example, to add the type of smart home system, add a drop down. To add a smart home devices, again, add a drop down, add a checkbox, a file upload, a number choice, element, multiple choice, and all of those. But what if you want to get specific, if you want to know a little bit more or help us what we should add in those sections. So for example, for smart home devices, it said add a drop down menu. So let's go ahead and tell it, we'll ask it, what should we add, what should we add in those drop down menu? Okay, so let's go ahead and ask it. Okay, so we just added the request and what should I add in the drop down menu for the smart home devices? So let's see what it's going to suggest us. Now, you can use this and ask different type of questions to help you build that form on JotForm. So here we go, it's letting us know. Now, like I said, 
Um, maybe there isn't a template specifically for this and it's going to help us know what we, we need to add. So for example, in that drop down menu, it's telling us to add smart thermostats, smart lighting, smart locks, security cameras, smart home hubs, smart garage door openers, and all that list right here. So we don't have to stop and think, oh, what should I add? Or maybe you forgot to add it. In this case, no, it's letting you know. And if you wanna get more specific with that section, let's ask it. Okay, so now we're gonna tell it, can you suggest more specific choices? So here we go. We're gonna get more specific than what it already provided for us. Okay, so here we go. Smart thermostats, and then we have other sections for the smart lighting, and then it's gonna give us obviously some some of the brands that are available, smart locks, security cameras, and it's getting specific for each one of these elements. So, like I said, you can ask it several type of questions. And in this case, we're working with a smart home system. Well, smart home service. So let's wait for it to finish. Okay, it just finished and it provided more specific choices for each one of the choices it provided before. So it's getting more specific. And again, we can go ahead and ask it or more specific questions. But that is how you were gonna use the AI to help us build that form on JotForm. Now, all we have to do is start that form in a blank one, like I mentioned, start from scratch, classic form, and start dragging in all the elements that it told us to add. So for example, remember, here we go. So we'll add the first one, which is name, service request, the time frame, budget, all the, the easy ones, like the like general ones, and then we're going to add the more specific ones that are based on the business that we are asking it for. And in this case, a smart home improvement service. And we add all the elements just like it told us here. Now, if you get stuck with any one of these elements, for example, if you need to add some conditional logic, we can go ahead and ask it here for it to do it and provide us the instructions for it. But just like that, drag in the elements that it's going to tell you and you're good to go. And that is how you are going to use AI to help you build the form on JotForm. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that little bell notification to get notified when new videos come out. And that's a wrap.